We just spent six hundred dollars on costumes for no reason. <laughs> I'm actually very upset about that. All right, so we have this beautiful G550 here. This color, this is actually a paint color. It's called Desert Sand. Actually not paint, you guys, it's wrap. It looks so good that it literally looks like paint. You can't tell. If you were to see this car anywhere, you would probably think it's a custom paint job. The door jams are all done too. So as soon as you open the doors, you can't even see anything else, which I think is amazing. Let's try to see what the original color on this car is. That's actually, honestly, how good the wrap is done. You know, sometimes when people do wraps, you can always see like a small portion that hasn't been done that they can't get to. It's not tucked in correctly. Of course, all our wraps, piece by piece, everything comes out. Everything's tucked in behind the part of the vehicle. And you guys can tell there's nothing that you can see. It's probably some kind of a black, matte black color or something like that is what we think this is. That's how good this thing is. We can't tell. She actually wanted this color. So she came in and said, can we do it? She reached out to Mono. Mono said it could be done and it's done. She's going to be here Monday to pick this thing up. She's going to be very happy of the results. Very, very excited because it really literally looks like paint. So yeah, come to RDB if you want perfection. Ladies and gentlemen, Range Rover has hit a home run with this car. I love everything about it. This is a great everyday car. This car is in here for a few things. We're gonna do wheels. There's nice wheels being ordered for this car. We're doing 24s on this thing. Also, we're doing a two-tone wrap. So the customer wants to wrap half of the car on the lower side a different color. We're gonna do a matte, I think like a matte darkish gray, a little bit on the satin side as well. Uh, he's gonna keep a lot of the gloss black. It's gonna look really cool when we're done. So we're gonna take it to our wrap shop right now, start to uh, take this thing apart and uh, get this bad boy ready. You don't like this? No, I like the short one. Oh. I hate the long one. I like the full size one. Oh, this is full size? Yeah. This one is ugly. <laughs> Your fat ass is ugly. <laughs> so, as you guys can see, we have every single part labeled so we know what we're doing and we don't make any mistakes because this one's a little bit it's not your regular wrap there's a lot of stuff that the customer wants to leave the way it is now and add stuff to it so this one's a little complicated but we'll get it right Every day. Okay. What? The bill will come to your house okay. every day. Every day. Yeah. You take care of it? No, all the time he's blocked the driveway. Really? All the time. I don't know why. Why are you gonna park him in the, around the corner or whatever? Hey, you run the shop, huh? You're the Vic of this shop. Yeah. It looks like did. Goldberg. <laughs> Who? Goldberg. Who's Goldberg? The wrestler. All right, guys, we're over here at a wrap facility. There's something special going down. We have three brand new 2023 Range Rovers. Dealers don't even have this many Range Rovers. We've already done maybe four or five of them, but we have three here at the same time, and they're not simple jobs. These are actually getting all wrapped. All of them are getting wheels, completely modified, customized Range Rovers. The one behind me I'm super excited about because it's not your typical just satin black Range Rover or gloss black Range Rover. We're doing a full satin aluminum wrap on it, which basically means like a satin silver like we used to do back in the day. Everything is turning satin silver. We're painting the emblem satin silver. All the black you see here is still going to be satin silver. We're going to go maximum satin silver on this thing. Even the top, we're going to do satin silver. We're also doing our wheels on them with silver on the face. So it's going to be a really, really drastic change, which we have not seen on the new Range Rovers yet. All of them we're seeing are black or satin black with the same wheels, which are the RDB 45 or 50 spokes. So a lot of spokes. That one over there, which is black, is going to get a two tone wrap. The middle of the body of that car is going to be a charcoal gray. It's also going to get wheels. The one on my right is going to be satin black. So this Range Rover is going to be all satin black with the gloss black wheels. This one, you know, is going to be typical. The ones that we always do, it's going to kind of be the same. So, you know, not much to film there, but you know, the one behind me is going to be a very big drastic change. It's going to be the start of the new Range Rover modification industry, in my opinion. 
because that's just how we do it. We always do it first. We always cause the trends. So that's what's going to happen. A lot of people are asking about the 26s that we did on the other black Range Rover. So 26s actually fit really, really perfectly on the Range Rovers. No modification whatsoever. No rubbing whatsoever. Even the Cullinans don't do that. But you get kind of a shitty tire. So you have to remember that. You want that 26 inch look on these Range Rovers, you could do it, but you're gonna get a shitty tire. These are all getting 24s actually, so it's gonna have a healthy tire on there. It's gonna drive really nice. All new Range Rovers, we have one more coming, a white one that's gonna get wheels. So we're gonna probably have four new Range Rovers here this week. But yeah, you won't see this anywhere else, not even the dealerships. It's this dream car. I got one of these. Oh, I got the red eye. This is hey, not the red eye. Oh. <laughs> what kind of shit is this? I have the red eye. This is not the red eye. You're, uh, and he's charging his car. He's using everything about it. Guys, we are inside the McLaren 765 LT Spider. This car was that beautiful white with red interior car. As you can see, I'm sitting in it and it's all red around me. Everything is like red Alcantara in this. This was a custom ordered car. It does not come like this. It's all special ordered stuff. As you can see, even the headliner, everything here is red Alcantara. The steering wheel's red Alcantara. And again, it's a spider, so all of this is glass. And like I said, the outside was just a regular white. Uh, our customer Mo, he wanted to do something different. He didn't want the white on red look. So it is a good resale value, white on red too, but we wrapped it. Nardo gray is one of our favorite colors and it works on everything. This car is a little tough to wrap, as you guys know, we've been doing a lot of McLaren, 765 included. It's a little bit tough to wrap, but it came out flawless, really nice. It has the 1016 Industries carbon fiber hood. It has a full straight pipe, a tune, Novatec springs to lower it. The wheels are actually the previous wheels that were on his previous McLaren 765, the army green one that you guys saw. He has a new custom set of LMs on the way for this car. So for now, we are filming it with the previous wheels. The LMs are going to set it off even more, in my opinion, but for now this looks great the mclarens as you guys already know i'm not a big mclaren guy but this would be something that i would enjoy if you know i were to get a mclaren i haven't heard too many rattles yet that i'm used to with the mclaren especially the 765 but uh, there's still some rattling here and there this car shakes a lot vibrates a lot like right now my whole body's vibrating when i'm in idle i could even see the the rpm kind of fluctuating and that's because of the flywheel on this car i believe but yeah it's kind of like a race car so right now we're filming this guy and we're actually headed to the halloween store because we are gonna get Halloween costumes for our guys because we're gonna have a Halloween party on the episode after this, which is basically for Halloween. So, hope you guys enjoy it. I'm also wearing the new RDV shirt. This is limited edition for Halloween drop as well. It's blackout with SF90 in the back. I hope you guys enjoyed the 765 LT Spider. This is one of the hottest cars out right now. Travis Scott's on the board. Are you real? No, it's not. Vic was like, no way. I just went $600 on costumes for no reason. I'm actually very upset about that. But yeah, it's going to be fun. Uh, we got very random stuff. It's going to be really, really good. I don't know who's going to be who. We're going to figure that out. My Super Mario Brothers theme didn't work out as planned because we can't find anything. So yeah, Halloween, here we come. Halloween limited edition merchandise. You see the hat, this has already been out. However, we're releasing an all black version of this, limited edition up to only a hundred of them made only. 
forever. It's gonna have a tag in there with your number on there. I don't have it on right now because the sample wasn't even made in time, but we do have them ready at the warehouse. So fulfillment is very quick. We also have this shirt. As you can see, it's the RDV LA shirt. I was wearing it earlier, it got a little dirty. It's the only sample right now. We're gonna make a hundred of these as well. It's a blackout RDBLA, and the back of it has the SS90 we did. So get on there. Right now I'm at uh, Underwood Family Farms with my kid that's screaming, but we're still filming out here. And like I said, go on there now. Only 100 of the all black hat and the all black shirt available at rdbla.com.